YouTube and welcome to another moto vlog coming at you live from Sterling, Virginia. Oh yes, yeah, Sterling, Virginia. We're riding around Great Falls today by myself and we're going to be watching this video together. Uh, this video I recorded today and we're going to be going over it and just um, talking about some stuff. Talking about some things. I can't keep my hands in the video. I just can't do it. You might hear some blums, some blobs for my computer as it makes a bunch of noise. So just ignore that and um, let's get going. So I think I want to thank my uh, not so sponsor, Rocket Frog. You know I'm not a paid advertiser, but dang, do I not have the best beer in Loudoun County? Oh yeah, oh, the cans might not be the best though because that one almost didn't open. Ooh. Ooh, what's going on here? Let me grab a fork here and oh, no. there we go. Open that bad boy all the way. Take a drink. <sighs> Good stuff. This is the Cosmic Leap Indie Pale Ale. Oh, it is just absolutely delicious. Oh yes, just absolutely delicious. Mm. So, what we're doing right now is uh, going down beautiful Great Falls here. I don't know the names of any of these roads, to be perfectly honest with you. This is kind of like the straighter, more straight road that we're wandering down here. We're kind of getting to the more twisty stuff. You can see I'm catching a car pretty good. Now all of a sudden I'm slowing up just a little bit catch this car. It's a pretty good turn right here. Look at that head turn. Oh man. Come on. You gotta love that. That was like beautiful. That was just beautifully executed. Mwah, mwah, mwah. <laughs> gotta love that head turn. Keeping my head up. Turning my head nice and early. Using my peripheral to hit my, my marks. And just uh, staying safe and having a good time, right? I'm so sorry that I'm not looking directly at the camera if you can't see it. I'm probably looking up here, you know, because the camera's right below my TV. We're at the video playing on the TV, and I've got the camera down here and the video up here. So I'm looking up at the video to see what's going on. But of course, right now, well, <laughs> we're sitting behind a car. So sitting behind a car, I think, means it's drinky poo time. Oh yeah, very good, very good stuff. Oh yeah, so I see this biker here. I actually, he waved at me and I uh, I gave him like a, are you okay, like a thumbs up and he, and he waved. So I figured thumbs up and wave means he's okay and I don't need to stop. So I didn't stop, just gonna keep going. Just gonna keep going. I just wanna show you kind of what it's like here in fall. As you can see, some of the trees have changed colors, but a lot of it is still, you know, your, a lot of this is still, you know, your uh, your standard greenery, everything. We, we, and we, we do have a lot of evergreen trees here that stay green all year long. If you don't know that, um, so I'm gonna be taking a right here at this stoplight. And then I think some of the fun for myself will be done. I don't know if it's gonna make the video any more fun, hey. <laughs> But at least I'm going to be having some fun myself. This is a lot of fun to record like this. Uh, let you guys see me. I think the only downside is this camera only records for 30 minutes. So at some point I'm going to have to pause the video and then do like a countdown or something and like get it started and synced. I think, you know, the video and the audio, are they going to be perfectly synced? No, they might be like something like half a second off, or, you know, a tenth of a second off. Yeah, it is just going to be what it is because you can't see me talking. So if I'm, if what I'm looking at right now isn't the same as what you're looking at right now, if that makes any sense, if it's off, if it's shifted a little bit, you know, just, just getting crazy. Just Getting a little crazy, getting a little crazy, getting a little crazy. I don't get why more motorcycle vloggers don't do this. Because they, they, they spend all their effort going out and uh, vlogging, like, like capturing everything live. These are my live emotions. This is raw. 
But it's not raw, right? Because they set everything up. It's not like they went out on the video with no plan just to go ride and, and, and maybe just say whatever comes to mind because you can't make a great video like that, right? Because you're going to be sitting there in your helmet and you're not going to be really saying anything or doing anything or talking anything because you're thinking about riding. You're thinking about not dying. You're thinking about like surviving. I look down in the middle of that corner there. I don't know what that's all about. I think I've been doing a pretty good job of keeping my head up. So one thing I can tell you right now is, yeah, this is not going to be the best looking video. It kind of has the uh, high dynamic range thing going on here where the highlights and the shadows and everything are just so far apart, right? We're, 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 we're these dark darks here in the shadows and these bright brights when we're in the sun and there's like no way to really reconcile it. So we give them a good, that was a pretty fun turn, look at that. It still looks like I'm looking down when I turn left, so, oh excuse me, my beard's starting to come back up the wrong way. <laughs> just kidding, just a guess. <laughs> you know, the, the CO2. But yeah, I'm trying to keep my head and my eye, my, not my eyes, so I'm trying to literally keep my head like pointed up. At, so as I'm leaning over, I'm trying to like keep my head up. And here we go, this is always a dangerous intersection right here. You gotta kind of be careful. Really, really think you can get hit there. I think if I get hit anywhere doing this route, it's gonna be right there. <laughs> Love to see that guy get right out of my way <laughs> as we come up to some nice uh, little more twisty sections here. There is honestly a lot of really nice corners on this route. I gotta, I, I gotta get to the point where I've uh, memorized it enough to where I feel confident going out and doing this route on my R6. You know. It, it's pretty long, but it, there's a Lamborghini. Lamborghini. I wonder who's having more fun. I always think about that when I see supercars, right? Not who's having more fun per dollar, but who's actually having more fun? Me and my, me and my bike? Or him on his fancy, fancy supercar? I don't know. Is my head being clipped off the top? It's kind of hard for me to see what's going on here. I'm going to slouch in the chair back a little bit. <laughs> We'll see, we'll see. <laughs> I'm grabbing the remote here, I'm checking the time. Because, I, like I said, after about 20 minutes or so, I'm gonna take a little pause for the cause. And, uh, well, at some point, I'm gonna take a little pause for the cause and uh, I have to break this video up because it's a little more than 30 minutes. And this camera only records for 30 minutes at a time. It'll only make 30 minute long files, it's crazy. Even in 1080p, even in 1080p, it only records 30 minute files. I, uh, uh, that's annoying, so I'm gonna have to figure out some way to record these videos uh, going forward and getting around this. Because this is fun, I, I kind of like watching them on the screen and recording them like this, getting to talk to myself. Obviously I'm not talking much about the ride because I'm kind of overwhelmed with the whole recording of this. <laughs> So if you want some info right now, I've got myself a new lens. I've got the Canon 32mm 1.4 EFM lens. This is basically the best EFM lens you can buy for any amount of money. I think it is the most expensive EFM lens as well, so ugh, what are you going to do there? <laughs> mm. Now it's time to drink. Look at this guy. Holy moly, I think I actually... I don't know. We'll see what happens. I think I, I might make some moves here coming up. Let's see. Oh yeah, here we go. Here we go. Make a little, make a little bit of moves. And it actually looks like I'm kind of moving fast there when I do that. <laughs> it's pretty good. Like, look how compressed that is. Oh my gosh. I, I, I recorded this to low bitrate to my TV to see what it would look like on YouTube, and holy moly, this video just <laughs> isn't going to look great. But you can get the sense of fall here, like if you're someone who's watching from an area where there's not much in the way of falling, just look at this. You can see me going very slow there, kind of moving around. That's actually to avoid 
what looked like patches of wet leaves in the middle of that corner. And uh, yeah, I doubt I really needed to avoid them to stay upright, but uh, yeah, hey, you know, better safe than sorry. So I made the pass on that guy, and then almost immediately I get caught behind this guy. Now this, this is gonna be a bit of a trying time here. We are just stuck behind this Mercedes Benz, you know? And I can hear my cat howling. She's uh, meow, meow, you know, meowing, and uh, <laughs> she knows what's going on. She, she doesn't like being stuck behind Mr. Mercedes either. I think this is gonna be a solid five minutes behind this guy in this video, which is just a real shame. So I hope you stick around. I'm gonna drink a little bit of brew. Have a little fun. Would you hear that car? That, uh, the Alpha 4C? That should have been pretty nice. <laughs> oh, look at those colors though. I mean, it might it's probably all compressed and everything, but man, you can see the yellows and the greens and, and the reds and the oranges all kind of interleaving a little bit when you're looking up there. It's, it, it, it's quite beautiful out. And that's one thing, of course, when you're going fast and having fun on the bike and, and really enjoying the ride like that, you're, you're not as much enjoying the view, right? You can't do both. Because when you're enjoying the ride, you know, you're so focused on the road and road hazards. So you're, 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 you're focused on things that are, you know, five or six feet above the road and below, right? Whereas all the beauty is, is up high. You can't, yeah, you, know, you can't even see my hand right now, but all the beauty is, you know, up, it's up. So you can't focus on both. You're either looking at the road or you're looking at, you know, the beauty of the area around you. And it's just, this is one of the reasons why I like making these videos because I can kind of see how, how nice it is back here in the woods here. Oh man, this is just a great time of year. This is some of my favorite time of year. Oh, my kitty's going crazy. I wonder if you guys can hear all those meows. So you can see me slowing down here, and here we go, speed up. Let's go through this turn fast, yeah. I think I did a pretty good job of keeping my head up there. I'm already caught up to this car. I'm already caught up to him again. So I can't, <laughs> you know, make moves towards, you know, going out, uh, going fast. I'm, I'm talking about going outside. I'm looking at my cat. She wants to go outside, but she's an indoor kitty. Sorry, Kittas. You are an indoor kitty. So, with this going on, I wonder what's <laughs> the time now. 13.33 out of 38 minutes. <laughs> Not quite in the middle. So we're going to wait until we get more towards the middle here for a 3, 2, 1 stop moment. That's a beautiful house is. Now one thing you can't see, I do use the medium view. I, I talk about this a lot, but I do use the medium GoPro view. I think it looks a lot better. I think it uh, accentuates the speed and kind of shows not so much, it, it doesn't show so much like the view, but it, it shows like the speed. And it really gives you a sense of how fast you, you're going, especially with acceleration and whatnot. So I, I like that. And I, I do use the lower frame rate, but the downside, it's like you can really see me speeding up there. And then almost coming to a stop to go around that corner, because if I didn't, I'd be right in that Mercedes. I'd be right in that Mercedes. You can see me, I'm like, the light's green. I'm like pushing on the bars, come on, go on. Let's do it. I'm like, it's green, it's green. And then she's stopping. And then the yellow lights. So I'm just like, yeah, I don't have the bags on the bike today, so I can actually do that. <laughs> a little bit of lane sharing there. Get the hell out of that lady's way. I knew I had a video to make and sit behind that lady at the stoplight would have been the straw that broke the camel's back for me, at least recording this video. And it would have driven me absolutely crazy. Oh yes, 
That's just rocket frog. <laughs> it's focusing on my face, and it's at f1.4. Ah, we can't get too much in focus. So we got to be like rocket frog. Yeah, I'm named after a company that doesn't exist anymore. <laughs> so we're making this left, we're getting back, we're having some fun here. Getting back on these twisties. And there's not going to be much we can do there. Look at these houses. They, now, now you can kind of see the houses. Some of yeah, now these are more like McMansions, but even still, like look at that. That's just crazy, man. This is absolutely crazy houses. Look at those trees. The trees almost look like smoke. This is now. Now we got some cool turns coming up. Uh, you can see I kind of look down there. I, I don't know. I, it's like the way I'm canting my head makes the camera look like it's looking down. I can't tell if that's the case or if it's truly me looking down when I'm making left turns. But I can tell you this, after watching this video and going through this with you guys, I'm going to take an extra step to try to prevent that in the next video, get my head up more. But it seems like I'm doing pretty well in these right-handers, but in the left-handers it's just a little... Uh, it's just a little not so great. It's just not so great. See the right hand? Look at that. I kind of kept my head up and you can see through the turn just like I was. And I wasn't really using like my eyes. Like on, you know, I was looking kind of straight ahead. So, I don't know. Ooh, that's beautiful there. Oh, you can see me kind of <laughs> act weird just to stay on my side of the road. I mean, there was no real reason for me to stay on my side of the road. Obviously, there's no oncoming traffic, but like... It's more fun that way, right? It's more fun to uh, paint inside the lines because it makes you uh, move the bike around more. <laughs> Quick stop here. Pretty cool, right? Nice and slick. Like, I thought that guy was coming at me, so I was a little nervous. <laughs> that would have been a nice spot right there to uh, stop my bike. This is where we actually end up coming out from. We make a little figure of eight um, going going from here on. So this, uh, I'm almost done with my first beer. Well, if you think this is my first beer of the day, I got a bridge to sell you. <laughs> did I drink before this ride? No, I did not. I did not drink before the ride, but. <laughs> I did have some drinks afterwards while I was uh, deciding what exactly to do with this footage, whether I wanted to post it or not. I kind of got the idea. I'm going to show you the whole thing. The good, the bad, the ugly. Just the whole twisty ride of this area. Just to give you a sense of like, if you come out here to Great Falls and you do a nice route and you, you plan out where you're going to go, because I'm using my GPS, the Garmin Nav 5, and I'm planning out where I can go and, and all that. You're gonna have a you're gonna have a pretty decent time. Is it gonna be perfect? No, no, it's not gonna be perfect, but it's gonna be a pretty decent time. So you can't you can't complain too much. Hmm. <sighs> what are we looking at here? We're about 20 minutes, so this is gonna be a pretty good spot for me to take a pause for the cause. I think what I'll do is, okay, I think what I'll do is we'll do this next sector here, and then when we hit the next stop sign, I will try to pause it. And hopefully I can sync all this shit up. Oh, oh yeah, there was a deer there, you see me speed up and then slowing down, ooh shit, deer ran right in front of me, you probably couldn't see it in the camera, but it was... It was there on the road. It was there on the road, on, on the uh, on the oncoming traffic lane. But it was there, so you know, I stopped because there, where there's one deer, there might very well be more. Now check this out, look at that shit in the middle of the road. <laughs> you go ahead and you ride over that crab while you're leaned over and tell me how, how, how good it feels. Yeah, I feel like I'm looking down while I'm 
I'm going left even at lower speeds. Whereas when I'm going right, look at that. It looks like my head's on like a freaking gimbal or something. So right turns are pretty good. Yeah, that was nice. Let's see how this next left comes. Now that we're in the twisties. This is probably going to be a down look. Yeah, but see the road looks down, so it's pretty cool. But yeah, I feel like I'm, I'm tilting my head downwards a little more than I need to for left turns. And it's ruining my shots. It's ruining my shots. <laughs> I'm just being completely crazy. Just being completely crazy here. Well, if you're still here, I'm very happy that you're uh, continuing to watch my videos and uh, support. You're not supporting shit, but you know, supporting what I do emotionally and statistically. And like always in these uh, these roads, the fun begins to come to an end when we uh, run into a bit of a car. But I think I'm gonna finish my drink. No, and I'm gonna pause now. No, 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 I didn't pause. How do I pause? Oh, synced up, not synced up. We'll find out. Mike good, Mike not good. We'll find out. Let's crack this beer. Oh yeah. Crack this whip. I don't know any of the words to that song. This one opened up pretty good. Yeah. Oh, but the tab came off real fast. Weird. Oh, well, let's drink it. Oh. Mm. Good stuff. Get a little buzzed. Get a little buzzed. <laughs> well, now we're back on Georgetown Pike. I know some of these roads. I know one of these roads. <laughs> just one. So now I see after the way. This is just going to be an infuriating. This is going to be an infuriating mess because I don't know the route too well. So you'll see what ends up happening. Oh, I hope I didn't make too much noise there. I accidentally, I don't know why, I felt the need to touch my lap mic and make sure it was in the right spot. How stupid am I? I'm not doing a whole nother take for that. Y'all are just gonna have to live with the fact that that sound was in my video. Yeah. I hope the quality of this is good. I do not know. I do not know. How is the quality gonna be? I can tell you right now, the quality of the ride right now has been mediocre. There's been some good spots, but you know, it's like if there was no traffic at all, it'd be a whole lot better, right? <laughs> Look at this crap. Ugh. This is just what happens. Look at these houses, man. Let's take a look at this house on the road. Look at these bushes here. It's like giant. Oh, look at their head, their fence. Someone crashed into their fence. <laughs> I shouldn't laugh. But it's like, who cares? Deal with it. You know, those house signs for like, oh, get the house for the low one millions. Yeah. Because that's affordable for people. So you can see me falling back. That's mostly because, again, I know there's uh, a couple turns coming up in the road. And I would like to, you know, have a little bit of fun. Have just a little bit of fun. Oh, man, can I finish this beer by the time this uh, video's over? I don't think I can. It's also getting, it's getting a little, uh... It's just a little dark outside. I wonder how that's affecting this video. We, got a, we had a lot of natural light coming in just just a few minutes ago, but now, now it's getting a little dark. Oh, we'll find out. We'll find out. Crack that whip. Do, do, do. I don't know the words. Do, 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 do. 
I'm gonna get a copyright, get a copyright strike. Yeah, probably. <laughs> so we're going down here, and I feel like pretty soon is where my turn is, but I, you'll see what happens. I end up actually missing my turn. I, I think it's this right. I think it's this right, right here, is my turn. And then I look down, and I'm like, oh yeah, that looks tight. And I look down, I'm like, wait, that's where I'm supposed to go. Ah, oh, crap. <sighs> and that traffic's going like completely stopped almost because we got all these guys walking along the road on this like super narrow, dangerous shoulder we got here. And they're just like walking along the road. You can hear them chanting some crap or another, or yelling something. I, I, I was, they were loud when I passed them, which is kind of funny. So I'm gonna turn around. This is where it's always good to have good skills when it comes to like U-turns. You know, I know I'm gonna have a hard time getting out here, so I'm like, I'm gonna F and force the issue, man. Like right there. I'm like, that guy's got brakes, he can slow down for me. <laughs> So I make the U-turn, heading back to some more twisties, but of course, because I did it wrong, I ended up getting stuck behind a van, so you gotta love when that happens, and of course I was going to stop because I don't know this intersection coming from the left, I've never made a left turn on this road before, well, not that that matters or means anything, let's drink a little bit of beer. Yeah, we got one lane bridges all over Great Falls, but this one needs a sign. That one needs a sign. Oh, I can feel all that liquid in my tummy. Look at that giant dirt pile. There's like dirt coming up. I could feel it get into my eyes. I had to close my shield, even though we weren't really moving fast. Yeah. And this is where things start to really stink, right? It's like, you've got this great road that you can just like, kind of go a little crazy on, but mm, you kind of can't because there's a van and then blind corners, blind hills. It's just, passing this guy would be a fool's errand, right? I don't know what you guys think, but I think it would be a fool's errand. So we're just cruising along like usual, taking a little cruise like usual, having a little fun like usual, yeah. Looks like I see this corner, I want to take it, I want to take it fast, I want to go, I want to move. <laughs> I just can't do it. I just can't do it. But he's from Florida, so it's okay. And now we get stuck on this road like, you can see I'm moving a little faster now in this 40 speed limit. We got this BMW here and we're actually kind of cruising. Man, my neighbors, I can hear my neighbors uh, playing some music here. I wonder if it's gonna come through on the video. Yeah, good for them, they're having fun. Having a good time. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? It's crazy how well this face autofocus stuff works. It's like I can. Ooh. And I'm in focus the whole time, even at a really fast aperture. It's crazy. I love it. Th th this camera. It's just amazing. This is like, for me, I'm not a vlogger, like, right? I'm not carrying the camera around with me, walking around. Hey guys, I'm uh, doing my, my walking around vlog. I don't do that. I don't do walking around vlogs, right? Ooh. Coming to a stop, but you know, I can break pretty quick. <laughs> Yeah, I don't do my walking around vlogs, so image stabilization isn't really a big deal. 
So that's nice. I also am doing these sitting vlogs. So, so this f1.4 lens allows me to use very low ISOs while I'm recording indoors with pretty crappy lighting. So I get very good, you know, clean results. I can scaled up or blown down and I can push the colors around, I can do all kinds of stuff because the ISO is so low. Who cares? ISO, give me a break. Right. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. Hey, I gotta fill, you gotta fill 40 minutes with dribble somewhere. So how about my new tires? I haven't really talked about those. Um, if you've made it to this point in the video and you're still listening, um, thank you. And let's let's talk about my times. So, ooh, I said alpha again. Alpha, alpha, alpha. Let's talk about my ties. Um, I got the Anarchy Adventure. Ooh, there's a biker. Hey, I can't talk about my tires when there's a biker and I've got to accelerate. Make myself look cool in front of the biker. He doesn't even follow me. He goes straight across that intersection. I don't know where he went, went there. I gotta maybe figure out if that's a tight road that he was on or going to or whatever. Who knows? I, I don't know the roads in that area. I should have figured it out. I, I, w I wish he would have gone across and I would have seen it. Maybe it would have like diverted my route and like followed him, you know? See if any of those corners were tight. Those tight corners, you know what I'm saying? Now, do you know what I'm saying? Because I don't mean like radius. Radius. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I don't mean radius. I mean, you know, are these corners awesome? Are they great? Do they inspire awe in myself? Uh, and I see this guy turning left, and I'm like, I gotta turn left too. Stuck behind this bloody Lexus. Always, always stuck behind a bloody Lexus. You see a 50 mile an hour left hand turn sign though, and you're like, yeah. Yeah, moving through that left hand turn a little bit. But I'm already right behind this guy. And it's like, what are you supposed to do, you know? I don't know, I gotta maybe revise this route a little bit. I'm just not sure. Cause I think this is a route, we're actually going back down a road I went the other way on. I'm, I'm really just, you know, exploring the area still at this point and I'm trying to figure out kind of like what's the best, you know, Great Falls route to kind of hit all these hit some of these cool roads and you know have some fun while also keeping the route at a reasonable level like maybe this route's a little long ah, I don't know I just don't know I think maybe if I hit le a little less traffic it would have been a lot more fun but it is what it is on like a Saturday I, I think I gotta try to hit it up more like like mid morning maybe or maybe even hit it up on like a weekday like that'd be pretty tight right I, I'm gonna I'm gonna my, my work schedule is gonna change a little bit coming up here and I might be able to start working around like I don't know yeah California stop sign law no cop, no stop, ain't that the way it works? Ah, <laughs> oh, jeez, I'm just ridiculous. I don't know why I was doing that, but this is a... I'm, I, again, I'm not really sure where I was going. I think right here is where I used to be. Oh no, I'm slowing down for this turn, okay, okay. Like, sorry for the turn, yeah. Do, do, do. Grab that whip. Do, 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 do. Ah. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Digging for gold, right? Ah. Yeah. I'm 
trying to make memes? Well, maybe. Meme me. Meme me. Meme me. I don't know, but right as soon as I gotta get solved. Now this is my little uh, shortcut. Oh, so cute little doggy. Oh, it's my little shortcut to get over to uh, Route Seven. This is a uh, this is a uh, winding down the video here, guys. Um. Yeah, I mean, we've only got like a couple more minutes, and then we're done. So, um, again, I, I want to thank you for sticking around. Anyone who's watching this, uh, you're, you're just awesome. Putting up with my crap and, and actually finding it even a little bit entertaining is very odd for me to think of. That I can pass some time in, in another person's day. But you know, I post this publicly on YouTube. I share my content. I like the show and you do whatever. If I put the effort into it that some other guys do, I'm not gonna name names. No, I don't. This is like a diary for me, you know? Like, uh, like I always say, you know, I'm trying to record my day, record my thoughts. And my big thought here was, it looks like my right turns are getting a little better. I'm uh, doing better with my head and my eyes. Excuse me. But with my left turns, I'm kind of still ducking. You can see it. I'm, I'm, I'm ducking my head a little bit. And I'd like to keep my head up on my left turns a little more. So that, that's something I'm definitely going to work on going forward. I might have to exaggerate it. Like, really... Uh, you know, like pick my left, my head up when I'm turning the left. I don't know. But we're getting pretty close, guys. Um, it was a fun ride. You know, traffic, whatnot. Mm. Had some good beers, had some good times. You're going to be watching my ugly mug this whole ride, you know. <laughs> oh, I just had a good time. And then we get to have a little bit of nice acceleration. So I'm going to shut up. I'll let the bike speak for itself here for a minute. Alright guys. I want you all to stay safe. And I want you to think about your riding.